Welcome back. All month long, we've been focusing on self care since September is National Self Care Awareness Month. So in this week's Your Best Life, we're talking about morning rituals, why they're so important, and the wide range of activities you can do to start your day off right. Morning rituals are the things you do to start your day. It's a habit. It's a uh, it's a pattern that you're creating in your life. Whatever makes you feel positive, happy, empowered, those would be the things to do. Johan Erb and Rachel Pringle Erb are relationship coaches and breathwork teachers. They say morning rituals can vary, but at their core, they help you connect with yourself. What I really always come back to is, is it is an opportunity to be intimate with just you. And we're always focused on out external things, outside things, and we lose that connection to ourself. And when we lose a connection to ourself, that is the first sign of depression. When we're not connected, we start to feel sad and isolated and lonely. And so the morning practice is a way to reconnect to ourself, to our values, to our beliefs, to our heart and our soul every single day. And then you build the whole day off of that foundation. It's time to burpee. Johan and Rachel's morning rituals are pretty different. Johan starts his days with burpees, which honestly sounds terrible. These practices are a reminder for you every day, even if you don't feel like doing it. Right? Part of my morning practice is doing burpees every morning. I have to do burpees. Do I want them every morning? No, but I do them anyway. Rachel likes to start her morning drinking water, then moving her body. As soon as I move my body, it literally shifts my state and it gets my energy moving. And I think the most important thing in the morning is for me to move my energy. Now, several weeks ago, I asked you guys to share some of your morning rituals with me on my Facebook page, and here are some of our favorites. Joanna says, my morning ritual involves a lovely cup of coffee, meditation in my backyard, beginning with a soothing scream at 2020 for being such an awful year. Isabel says, my morning begins with getting dressed, walking my dog, Tai Chi, meditation, writing in journals and prayers. Anne starts her day by writing positive messages on the bathroom mirror for her husband. I love this one. He is super lucky. David is kicking off things for his day by reading the Bible, praying, and riding his bicycle. And Christine also likes to move her body in the morning. She goes for a walk, plays with her dogs, and tries to beat her husband at solitaire. So thanks so much for sharing, guys. And remember, morning rituals, they don't have to be long or feel like a routine. Just simply spend a few minutes doing something that makes you feel good, and you will see a positive impact on your whole day.